uh, it is given that uh, uh, the message signal uh, is having the density function from uniform density function from minus 3 to 2 it was given. So, density function is given means the message signal we can treat as a random signal and that I am treating as mx. It is having uniform density function from minus 3 to 2 and uh, this signal is uh, given to a non-uniform quantizer and here it is given that uh, if the random signal voltage is less than 0, less than 0 then that is quantized to minus 1 volts this is quantized to minus 1 volts and uh, and uh, it is quantized to plus 2 volts when the input voltage is greater than or equal to 0 volts. If the random signal takes the values greater than 0 then quantized to 2 volts here quantized to 2 and here we have to find out um, the quantization noise power to be find it. So, quantization noise power means uh, this is uh, n q I am denoting with so, it is uh, expectation of q e square it is power of q e quantization noise means quantization error and we have to find power of q e that is expectation of q e square and uh, q e is uh, sampled voltage minus uh, quantization voltage. So, it is x minus x q I am taking this as. So, it is expectation of uh, x minus x q square. So, it is integration. So, minus infinite to infinite, but random variable takes the values from minus 3 to 2 x minus x q square into f x of x dx. If random variable takes the values from minus 3 to 0, then uh, that will be quantized to minus 1. So, quantize it to minus 1, x q is minus 1. So, x plus 1 square and f x of x. What is f x of x value is 0 0.2 dx plus. If random variable x takes the values from 0 to 2, then quantize it to 2 volts. So, x q is 2 volts. So, x minus 2 all square f x of x is 0 0.2 dx. Okay. Here the total area of density function should be equals to 1. So, here the length is 5, it is a rectangle. So, height is 1 by 5 that is point. And if you do this and it will come to, it will be 17 by 15 watts this is.